QC Industries conveyors are always tracked before leaving the factory, but tracking should always be checked before the conveyor is first run or after the belt is changed. If the belt comes in contact with either bearing plate, the tracking should be adjusted. To begin, loosen the tracking block screws on both sides of the conveyor a half turn. Use a quarter inch wrench to turn the tracking screw, a quarter turn at a time, to move the belt away from that side of the conveyor. When the belt can make a full revolution without touching either side of the conveyor, the belt is properly tracked. Retighten the tracking block screws on both sides of the conveyor to lock in the setting. Occasionally, the tracking will need to be fine tuned by rotating the eccentric bushing at the tail end of the conveyor. Begin by loosening the button head cap screw. Use a 9 16th inch wrench to rotate the bushing clockwise to move the belt away from that side of the conveyor, or counterclockwise to move it toward that side of the conveyor. When the belt can make a full revolution without touching either side of the conveyor, retighten the button head cap screw to lock in the setting. 